Hello, welcome back to The Daily Trend. With Thanksgiving just around the corner, it's time to elevate your turkey game. Today we've got three must-try turkey recipes that will make your Thanksgiving feast unforgettable. Let's dive in. Ingredients. One turkey preferably 10 to 12 pounds, one quarter cup fresh herbs, plus 20 whole sprigs such as thyme, rosemary, sage, oregano, and or marjoram. Divided, two tablespoons canola oil, one teaspoon salt, one teaspoon freshly ground pepper, aromatics, onion, apple, lemon and or orange cut into two inch pieces, one and a half cups, three cups water plus more as needed. Directions, position a rack in the lower third of the oven, preheat to 475 degrees. Remove giblets and neck from turkey cavities and reserve for making gravy. Place the turkey, breast side up, on a rack in a large roasting pan, pat dry with paper towels. Mix minced herbs, oil, salt and pepper in a small bowl. Rub the herb mixture all over the turkey. Under the skin and onto the breast meat, place aromatics and 10 of the herb sprigs in the cavity. Tuck the wingtips under the turkey. Tie the legs together with kitchen string. Add 3 cups water and the remaining 10 herb sprigs to the pan. Roast the turkey until the skin is golden brown, 45 minutes. Remove from the oven. Cover the breast with a double layer of foil. Cutting is necessary to conform to the breast. Reduce oven temperature to 350 degrees and continue roasting until an instant red thermometer, inserted into the thickest part of a thigh without touching bone, registers 165 degrees, 1 hour and 15 minutes to 1 hour and 45 minutes more. If the pan dries out, tilt the turkey to let juices run out of the cavity and into the pan and add 1 cup water. Transfer the turkey to a serving platter and cover with foil. Let the turkey rest for 20 minutes. Remove string and carve. Prepare the salt mix up to two days in advance by grinding salt, thyme leaves, and pepper. Place the turkey in a roasting tin and carefully insert fingers under the skin from the neck, ensuring not to tear it. Season the turkey thoroughly with the salt mix, both inside and out, including under the skin. Keep the turkey in the tin, breast side up, and refrigerate for up to two days for enhanced succulents. For a crispy skin, leave the turkey uncovered to dry out, or loosely cover it if preferred. Combine butter, vegetable stock powder, and lemon zest in a small bowl. Chill the mixture, which can be made in advance and frozen for up to one month wrapped in cling film. Take the turkey out of the fridge about an hour before cooking. Allow the butter to soften. Preheat the oven to 180 degrees. Calculate the cooking time based on 40 minutes per kilogram for the first 4 kilogram, plus an additional 45 minutes per kilogram thereafter. Spread the softened butter under the turkey's skin covering the entire breast and working it into the crevice between the thigh and body. Place onion, lemon halves, and garlic in the cavity. Loosely cover the tin with foil and roast according to the calculated cooking time. Approximately 30 minutes before finishing, raise the oven temperature to 200 degrees, remove the foil, baste the turkey, and return it to the oven. Once the turkey is beautifully browned and cooked through, remove it from the oven, letting it rest on a warm platter covered with foil for up to one hour. Save the tin juices for gravy. Last but not least, the bacon-wrapped roasted turkey. Preheat oven to 325 degrees Fahrenheit, Remove giblets and neck from turkey. Rinse turkey with cold running water and drain well. Blot dry with paper towels. Chop onion and garlic and mix together. Once chopped and mixed, stuff the onion and garlic mixture into turkey. Tie up the turkey's wings, legs, and drumsticks with kitchen twine as desired. Chop sage and mix in with softened butter. Rub sage butter mixture under the skin and over the skin of the turkey. Salt and pepper turkey to taste. Place uncooked bacon slices all over the skin of the uncooked turkey. They will stick onto the buttered turkey. Insert an oven-safe meat thermometer into the inner thigh area near the breast of the turkey but not touching the bone. Place turkey in a roasting pan and use foil to tent the uncooked turkey. Remove foil tent for last hour of cooking turkey. Continue to let bacon cook on turkey for an additional 15 minutes, then remove. Optional. Bacon can then be chopped and placed in a separate dish of your choice. Remove turkey from oven once 160 degrees is reached internally in the turkey. Allow turkey to rest for 20 to 30 minutes. During the rest period, turkey will continue to cook to 165 degrees. Now you're ready to carve. Enjoy.